just realised the chance of me being able to read that uh, almost nil. So, yeah, so hi, uh, I'm Sarah Allen and I run um, Further and More, and our one and only mission is to make job sharing business as usual. Um, so job sharing, for those of you that don't know, is when two people jointly fulfil a full-time role. Um, and we think it's a really important part, um, a really disruptive part of the future of work. So I'm going to do an experiment and hope it pays off. Um, so if you think about your current role now, um, or if you hate your current role, imagine one that you'd really love. Um, and if you could do that role and continue on a really ambitious career trajectory and fulfill all your goals, but you would like to do that on a three day week instead of working full time, would you put up your hand? So that's, that's kind of how it plays. Um, so when I started further and more, I didn't really do much um, market research. And the reason for that was because it felt like almost every conversation I'd had for the last 10 years or so was market research. Because I couldn't remember the last conversation at school gates or when I went out for dinner when someone didn't say a version of, I've got a double first from Oxford, I used to run McKinsey, and I'm an accountant in North Finchley, and I feel really frustrated about that. Um, <laughs> Because, because how things work now is, is obviously not working. And that's kind of the crux of the matter. There is this enormous pool of brilliantly talented, largely women, largely mothers, but by no means exclusively, who are ambitious, who are highly skilled, who are highly educated, who have a massive contribution to make, who just can't do it full time. And they can't do it full time because they're mothering or they're looking after their ailing parents or, I don't know, they're mountaineering or gardening or whatever, but they just don't want to work full time. And on the other hand, there are these really brilliant, exciting, challenging jobs, which are leader roles, which will change society, uh, which are really well paid, um, and they can't be done part-time. And job sharing, we say, is the only working pattern that truly addresses that. Because everyone knows part-time actually means you work full-time, you, you just don't get paid for it. <laughs> and when we speak to job sharers, and they tell us about why it means something to them, why it's important, yes, they talk about the working pattern. And yes, they talk about being able to fulfill their career goals, but actually the picture is much more vivid and nuanced than that. So they talk about what it feels like to be the only woman in, in the room in, in a kind of in a senior meeting or whatever, and how isolating that can be and how combative that environment can be. And actually being part of a job share for almost everyone we speak to is about being part of a unit. And even if your job share pair is in the library or the sandpit, you're still a unit of two. And that's really powerful and it makes a really big difference to people's ability to progress. Plus, job sharers are 30% more productive. For employers, it means that if one person's on annual leave or they're unwell, there's still continuity across the piece, or indeed if someone leaves. And job sharers are really creative, they're really innovative, they solve problems absolutely brilliantly together, their outcomes are enormous. And, and actually when you think about work and our access to work, and of course job sharing isn't just about women and it's very vivid for lots of demographics, but when we think about access to work and when we think about making a change on International Women's Day, making sure that women can access those big jobs, that they can participate on, on their own, on their own terms really it's absolutely pivotal to making a big social change and so that's you know that's why we're doing it's not always what I say when I'm in the room with a big multinational but that is why we're doing what we're doing right it's about re rebalancing power and enabling all of us to participate on our own terms in the world of work <laughs>